Kylie, where are you? Kylie! What are you doing? I'm making sure what you love me is good for backpacking. Okay, remember I told you we were going to put the scene in the shower yeah. before this, so we got to act like it already happened, okay? That's going to be weird feeling, but okay. That's how filming works. Filming is all mystery and magic and smoke screens. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Adventure Widely. Today we are going to talk about the Marmot Precept Jacket for kids. This jacket is slightly different than their adult version, but it's a very good jacket. Much better than a vinyl rain jacket that you might find at a department store. Uh, I have a 10 year old here who I think is excited about this. Are you excited about this? Yep. Why? Because it's fun. Okay, because it's fun. <laughs> Uh, she loves to go backpacking with me and other kinds of outdoor activities, and this is the jacket that I've had with her for several different versions now, uh, as she has grown. Um, so as you can see here, the jacket next to her, this is the Marmot Precip. Uh, this is a uh, girl's large. They make this jacket in both a boy's and a girl's version. Uh, unlike the adult version, we'll jump right into this, it does not have pit zips. And if you watch other videos of mine, I'm a big proponent of the pit zips. Uh, however, they do have a compromise with this jacket, and they have vented pockets. So if you open the pocket up, so you see my hand through here is a mesh fabric. So the pockets on this jacket do vent. Uh, it also has a hood that can roll into the collar, and the collar has Velcro on it, so you can hide the hood out of the way. It has a fleece lined collar as well so it doesn't feel clammy against the skin when you are in a moist environment. Uh, and it is the same uh, membrane material that they use in their adult versions of the Precept jacket. So it is definitely a waterproof breathable material and all around it is a excellent jacket for kids in the backcountry. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so we'll have her go ahead and put this jacket on, if you would Kylie. Okay, this is a girl size large. Uh, Kylie is approximately four foot eleven now. Do you know? Four foot ten. Four foot ten. We'll have to measure her. Uh, four foot ten. She is approximately a hundred pounds. Go ahead and zip the jacket up. Mm -hmm. Zip the jacket up. <laughs> I'm like, don't get the hair. So she did still fit into a girl's medium, which was the jacket she had before, but it was starting to get a little snug in the chest and also short. So we ended up getting a girl's large. Uh, this jacket, if you put the hood up on it, mm. so you can see how the hood fits. Go ahead and do a turn around with the jacket on. Turn around slowly. <laughs> All right, as you can see here, she has uh, Velcro to cinch this up, keep everything out of the way, help keep the weather out. Uh, it does not have any uh, it does not have any adjustable pull cords, it just has elastic bands on here. Um, so that's another difference from the adult version of this jacket. With most of the floppy brims like that, I usually wear a ball cap underneath my rain jacket just to help keep the, the hood out and away from my face, especially if it's really windy out. Alright, through the power of editing, we now have her wearing a hat underneath her rain jacket as well. As you can see here, that really helps support the, the brim of this and keep it away from her face and give her a little bit of extra protection having that flap that gets her, her bridge of her nose. But overall, you can see this jacket fits, fits her well. She does have two pockets that she can put her hands into. She can also zip those up to help keep more of the weather out. Um, but an excellent buy, and if you're going to do any kind of backcountry activities with your children, especially if you're out there for multiple days, it is highly advisable that you have uh, good quality rain gear so they are comfortable and they are actually able to enjoy what's going on outside and not have to worry about being cold and miserable. Uh, as you've seen in other videos of mine, kids uh, have a slightly less tolerance for being uncomfortable in the backcountry than us adults do. So the more we can make them comfortable, the more they're going to enjoy it with us, and the more they're going to turn into lifelong adventurers. So thanks again for checking this out, and hopefully uh, if you like this video, uh, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel please, and I'll continue to make more great content. Thanks again, have a great day, keep adventuring widely. Thank nice you. idea to put your book on you gonna say goodbye? Adios, amigos. You gonna say a real goodbye? <laughs> say a real goodbye. Goodbye.
and bye. I feel like my head's trying to be squeezed. Get my brain juice out here. Go ahead and fix your hat. Fix my hat.